Well, hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley and this is Bliss Studio Hobbies. So for this video, I have a diamond painting accessories haul. I have several packages here that I'm gonna share with you guys. So let's get started. So the first package I am going to open is this one because I've had this package for so long. I believe I ordered this in November and it took like several months to get to me. It's from the UK. And now um, I think I've had this package for three, maybe four months. So without further ado, let's get it open and see what we got. So this package is from Shiny Shazza on Etsy. I will link everything that I bought down below so you guys can take a peek. I believe her name is Sharon. Um, and I believe her name is also Shiny Shazza on Instagram as well. It's been so long, I barely remember like what I ordered. So what she does is resin. She has a resin shop where she has a beautiful resin pieces. Ooh. Alrighty. Oh, there's a little, I think I need to open this. There's a little note in here that I noticed. All right. Shiny Shaza. Thank you for your order. It's like caring for your resin drill tray and cover minder magnet. So I'll read that later. But if you guys wanted to take a look, there it is. All right. So we got some packing peanuts. We have a little dum dum sucker. Let's get into the good stuff. All right. So I've been obsessed with these little bears. I've seen them in several shops, but they're just so cute let's open this one up oh my gosh and this is one of the bigger bears it is a cover minder so you can put that on your diamond painting cover to hold it back look how pretty that is that's resin a little resin bear with those gold flakes in there i love it it's so cute so i got the bigger bear and i got one of the smaller bears Let's get that one open. <laughs> That's a cover minder as well. Oh, the magnets did come off, but I have some E6000 and I can glue that back on myself, no worries. But look how cute that little bear is with all those colors. Pretty resin, I love resin. I do, I have done a couple of resin projects myself, but I'm not like an expert or anything or even, in advance um, at resin, but these are cute, cute, cute little bears, cover minders. And then, oh, all the magnets wanna stick together. So let me leave them separated. I have this little tray here. When I am diamond painting, I love working with trash trays. They're like really easy for me to work with. And then I thought that little heart was so cute. And it is also a cover minder. Look how cute that is, a little trash tray. And I bought a big resin tray. So yeah, the stopper was sold separately, I believe. And then let's see. Now, when I first heard about this shop, there was a, like a big butterfly tray in the shop and I went back to get it and it was gone. So I got this one, which has a butterfly on it. But, oh my gosh, this is really heavy duty. It has that beautiful butterfly. You know, I love butterflies. And it has shiny Shaza engraved on the side. That's pretty, both, both sides. Oh, I love that. I'll have to work with it and see how it works out. Oh, the grooves are deep. I think that's going to be good. And it's heavy duty, too. Heavy duty with the stopper. I don't know which way the stopper goes, of course, but yeah, I don't know which way the stopper goes. I'll have to figure it out, but there's that. I have the big tray, the trash drill cover minder, the little bear cover minder, 
and the Big Bear cover minder. That's all from Shiny Shaza. I will link this shop down below. All right, guys, so I came back for a second because I finally figured out how to put the stopper in the tray. There we are. Thank you so much for watching my video. Bye-bye. All right, so the next package is from Bass Custom Arts. So I do have another package from them that I cannot find. So I, you know, I've just moved and I still have boxes upon boxes and I had two orders from them and I'm like, I cannot find my second order. So soon as I do, I will show you guys, but for now I just have the one. Bass Custom Arts, um, the pin, uh, she turns pins. She has a group on Facebook, which I will link down below and they now have a, um, a website so I did order this one like two months ago <laughs> and I have yet to open it so here I am sharing it with you guys I hope this is the pin one because I bought a pin and I bought something else for my second package but I don't know which package is which so we will be surprised together all right we have oh those are cute i've never seen like the packing peanuts with the little colorful hearts that's cute love it this is my receipt there all righty yay so it looks like this is my pen good so then my other item is the item that i need to find all right so here we go so there Here's their business card, Donna Bass. So cute. That's their Facebook group and their website. In here, we have some placers, a single placer and a four placers. I love four placers. They are my favorite and a cute little sticker. All right, let's get to the fun part, this pin. Thank you for your order. That's how they're packaged. Can't remember which pen I got. Oh yes, yes. I think this was called like a shark tooth bite or something like that. I do not quite remember what it's called, but look how pretty that is. Oh my gosh, with the rhinestones, so pretty. I love all the colors, the purples, greens, yellows. Isn't that pretty guys? Um, I believe my first turned pin was from her shop. Um, yeah, that's perfect. I wanted a smaller pin this time because, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't wait to work with this. It's so pretty. It's been a while since I bought a turned pin. So here we go. I absolutely love it. Thank you, Donna. She does some amazing work. So I think um, I haven't been in the group in a while but I do believe I'm gonna go ahead and put my I do believe that they have like pin pops on Thursday where it's like auction style and then they have stuff on the website but I will link the group and the website down below so you guys can check her out yourself there we go there's that pin I can sit there and show you guys forever so pretty there is that pin all righty so our next package comes from mad for minders they are on etsy i will link that shop down below as well this package i bought three or four months ago as well so i do not remember what i have oh here is their business card mad for minders mad for minders there we go I think I found this shop just by scrolling online. On Etsy looking for certain cover minders because I love my cover minders. Ooh. Ooh, looks like I have five cover minders. Alrighty. Oh, yeah. So 
I found this shop when I was going to do that um, Summer with the Masters event because I was going to do that Van Gogh painting that I didn't get around to because I was too busy. But yeah, that's how I found this um, company. So I have five cover minders here. I'm not gonna take them off um, because they are put on here perfectly. Um, this does say madforminders.com, which I will link down below, of course. It's two people see outside. I love that because I like to stay in and diamond paint. And then I have that Van Gogh sunflower magnet here. I did unbox this diamond painting on the channel if you want to take a look. Um, I have a light bulb that says be the light. I thought that was really nice. Hello, I'm socially awkward. Uh, that's me if any of you know me personally. And then bookworm because I love to read. So that is five cute little cover minders. I thought they were cute. And of course, I love my cover minders. You put them on your diamond painting to hold your covers back. So there we go. It's for madforminders.com. All right, guys, last but not least, we have an Amazon package. Um, this is partially opened because I've been getting a lot of Amazon packages and I couldn't remember what I purchased. Aha, uh -huh, there we go. So I have a diamond painting here. It's from Cotart. I have Unbox Cotart in the past on my channel and done a couple of post reviews, I believe. Um, so this diamond painting, I initially saw someone, who was it? I think Rachel Ray showed this diamond painting on her channel. And I'm like, that is so cute. And I really want it. So I went on Amazon and it was always out of stock, always out of stock for months and months and months. And then finally it was in stock. So I had to get it. It's from Coates Heart, and um, I love that they come in these little tubes, so you can store it in the tube when you're done with it. And I, yeah, I like really love this image, really love the image. So without further ado, let's open it up. I'm pretty sure I bought this when I was on a no buy as well. So there's that. Oh, there's tape here. There we go. There we go. And that's that. Alrighty. Oh, yeah, that's pretty. The painting is a little bit darker than I expected, but that's fine. That's okay because that's just the image here. That's not how it's gonna turn out. So you have your legend here. So what I'll do is cut this up and make it a sticker with my Zyron sticker maker. This one is a 16 by 20. I think all of the diamond paintings I get from Coltar are 16 by 20. They have several to choose from on their uh, Amazon store. We have labels. Labels are always good. A toolkit. They normally put like four pins in there, some baggies for kitting up, and a couple of bolts and tweezers. They have a little thank you note in there. That's cute. And then they have their drills. So let's look at the drills real quick since they're in my hand. I'm not going to take them out. It looks like it's good quality drills. We have a couple of stragglers in there, different colors. Um, I have worked on a couple of Kotar kits, and I do not recall having any issues with their drills, and they look like they're good quality from the package. All right, so let's get into this canvas. So this edge here that was kind of crinkled in the um, tube, I did have this issue before on a different canvas, and my canvas was kind of crinkled because of the tube. Um, and this one's like that. So with the other diamond painting, it made the glue less sticky. Oh, I shouldn't have a problem here. The other one made the glue less sticky. So I shouldn't have a problem there that's still sticky. And it was it was um, a lot more crinkled than this is. So I should not have a problem there. 
They have like the hard back firm canvas. It is pour glue, so I'm just going to roll it to get some of those wrinkles out. All righty. So what do you guys think of this image? I thought it was so cute. When we put the drills on, hopefully that brightens this up. It's like the sun. Love it, love it, love it. This is a round diamond panty. It has 26 colors. It's from Coltart. Um, hashtag Coltart DP on Instagram. And it's a 16 by 20. The drill field is clear. On the other kits I've done from them, the drill field has always been clear. So no issues there. No issues there. So yeah, that is my last box that I have to open for you guys for this video. I'm just looking and admiring the picture. I wonder how the detail is gonna be because the image looks really detailed. But with the 16 by 20, I'm not sure if I'm gonna get that level of detail that's in the actual image. So I'll just have to work it up and see how it goes. So that is all the things I have to show you all for this video. What do you guys think of all of my purchases? And did you see anything today that you will be willing to try? If you love diamond painting, crafting, and all things hobbies, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share my videos with a friend. Until then, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.